When you know the Yukon fight song for decades, and it's been part of who you are, and, and you have a degree from that institution, you should be incredibly invested in that place. We have a tremendous amount of pride. You know, we all played here. We all grew up in Connecticut. We've been here for a long time. We're very invested in it. We want to see the, the university, we want to see the program continue to grow. At the core in their DNA is the Huskies. So the loyalty there, I never have to question. They know the people on campus. They know what makes this place great. And there's only been four coaches in the last, what, about 80 years of this program. That consistency makes a big difference. We know each other so well, it's like a family, you know, you love each other and sometimes you, you hate each other at the same time. But that's also what, what makes us good, because we can, we can say things to each other. I think all of our personalities are, are clearly different, but I think one of the secrets to how we've been able to stick around is that each guy kind of does a different role and stuff. I would say Desi and I are probably your, your two more emotional guys up and down like that. And Jeff and, and Coach Penders are obviously uh, the even keel guys, but What's great is that coach allows us to coach with our style. I'm very fortunate to have all UConn guys. And um, I tell them, hey, I want to know how can I get better today? And uh, thankfully, it didn't take them long to, to do that. Got a baby, Jackie! It's on the ground, get here, down! Jim hasn't changed too much. Even when he was uh, a 19-year-old sophomore here on campus, he was still like the voice of the team. The guest speak somewhere, they were asking, you know, Jim Penders to be the guest speaker at 19 years old. He's very good at what he does. He's great at communicating with the players and knows how to run a program really, really well. When it comes to recruiting, um, when Coach Mack and myself are out on the road, we kind of know what Coach Penders likes to see. We know what each other, you know, what our, what our personal preferences are. We've been able to kind of recruit kids that complement, you know, what we're looking for from a talent perspective, but even what we're looking for from a style perspective. And I think that's probably, the, you know, one of the benchmarks of being with the staff for seven years. I think our players kind of see that. They see how much it means to us because we did play here, you know, and it, it, there's a lot of pride in what we do for our university. All five of us believe we're temporary caretakers of the program, and we need to leave it better than we found it, which is going to be a heck of a task. The message is still the same. You know, we're, we're going to try to play really tough, hard, blue-collar baseball, and we're going to try to represent the university and the state the best that we can every time we take the field.